the struggle is real. The struggle is real. Okay. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I got my newspaper. <laughs> All right, let's get it cracking. Nope, no, no. You cannot let that slide. One more time. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vinia McKell. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Today is another unnecessary video where I bought some more perfume oils from The Scent For You. And I'm going to unbox or smell them really quickly with you all. I didn't, I didn't get a lot of things. I just wanted to share the few things that I picked up that I did not need. Before I get into that, I have to thank my subscribers. You guys are amazing, incredible. Y'all be P.O.P. holding it down. And I know y'all gonna hold it down with me for this video because I'm actually very tired. This is my third video that I'm currently filming. My stomach hurts. I'm getting a little headache. It's a lot going on, but I'm here. The lights are on. Everything is plugged up. And who knows <laughs> the next time I feel like filming. So, you know, when I'm in the mood, I just try to push through and pump everything out as much as I can. Um, so that I can stay consistent and on top of my content. So, uh, my energy probably going to be a little low on this one because we hanging on by duct tape and Elmer's glue. But we're going to make it. <laughs> so, I got another order from The Scent For You. Well, really, what happened was, Lauren, you know, at Loso Natural, she uh, had bought some things. And she blamed me for it. It's hilarious. It's in the caption of the video. Um, but she ended up trying... Mad they have a version of Madagascar's the Nest Madagascar Vanilla, I think is what it is. And she was like, It's a time. So I was like, Well, that's all I needed to hear because I I can't commit to paying a hundred dollars for a perfume oil. I can't. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I can't do it. Like, not when I know I can get perfume oils from anywhere from three dollars to fifteen and get solid perfume oils that have amazing performance. Y'all see the myriad of places that I get perfume oils from. I actually should compile a list. Maybe I'll do that. Get a list of all the places that I've gotten perfume oils from. Um, and that I recommend. But I get perfume oils from a myriad of places, right? And they range from as cheap as $2.50. I think the most I paid is like $12.99 or $13.99. Paying $100 for a perfume oil? I can't. I can't. Not when I know I can get solid quality for significantly less. Even if I pay $10 for a perfume oil, I still can't. 90 100 I can't do it. So, once I seen they had the Madagascar Vanilla Perfume Oil from Nest. Yes, Madagascar Vanilla Perfume Oil. So, that was really my whole purpose for or from ordering this. I think I got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight things. So this shouldn't take long at all. Got my newspaper. Y'all already know what's up. Oh dang, I should um, you know, I need to unwrap these. <sighs> I've smelled a myriad of things today. Um, my arms and everything is just covered in things that smell. So I'm not gonna put this on my well. We have to put it somewhere. We we gonna we gonna pump through. We gonna push through. Um. Oh, I didn't know what this smells like because I have this. I just finished a bottle of this, which is why I repurchased this. This is YSL Libre Intense. Is that coming up? I don't know, but um, I already know what this smells like. I've used this and actually finished a bottle. This smells close enough to the original to me that a repurchase. Is justified yeah yeah that is close enough to me um for 250 it, it did it do it do it does it is what needs to be done okay oh this is what I want to smell Madagascar vanilla from the scent for you and if y'all be struggling to take it off do your scissors like this and spin that thing around like that so it cuts that and then you just oh hold on let me do before I start talking mess okay now <laughs> okay it does work oh I do like this and she said this one got better with time I do like it though don't get me wrong I do like it and I'm excited to see if this does get better as it sits would I like this for a hundred dollars no no for a hundred dollar perfume oil you need to 
I need every time I wear it, it should be five dollars deposited into my bank account for a hundred dollar perfume oil. Like it's gotta do something else besides make me smell good for a hundred dollar perfume oil. I, listen, this is fairy tale, which actually I don't need this. If I just bought Libre Intense, I don't need fairy tale perfume oil because uh fairy tale smells like libre everybody know that fairy tale is the bath and body works well you don't i definitely don't need this i just had to do it again so y'all know i wasn't crazy that it do work um i smell like so many things right now hold on <laughs> okay well let me say this smells different enough from libre intense that i can justify having fairy tale and libre intense this actually smells really good. I'm glad that I got this. Now this little hack I done showed you, if the tape being on there bothers you, then, you know, go through the process of peeling the tape off. But the tape being on there don't bother me. As long as I can get to the product, I'm good. Okay, this is Yum Pistachio Gelato, which I already know. I already got the best of the best with fragrant body oils. I just want to see if theirs is still hit. And I, I ain't gonna, I'm gonna tell the truth, shame the devil. This is good too. This is, I ain't gonna hold you, this is good too. Um, which one would I pick? This is close enough to the original, but fragrant body oils, it's just, there's something just a hair a little bit better that I prefer in their version. However, this is still close enough that would give you the same effect. But if you're talking about spot on, like to me, note for note, Fragrant Body Oils got it just a little bit better. There's something in here that's just a hair different to me, but I mean, for the sake of argument, you can get what you need from this one. The real, what would determine really, that young pistachio from uh, Gelato from Fragrant Body Oils lasts all day. Compliment getter all day. That will be the big determining factor, to be honest, is the longevity on this. It, you can smell it and clearly tell though it's supposed to be a version of Young Pistachio, like clearly. But it's it's still not beating my baby. It is good though. Don't mistake me. It's good. Okay, Fenty. Now I have smelled Fenty is one of those perfumes. Fenty and La Vie Belle. I have tried perfume oils from several places. Not all the places that sell it, but I've had it from at least two or three. And for some reason, those two perfumes, I've never smelled a version that's spot on to the original. I don't know what about what about those two perfumes is so hard to recreate, but so far Fenty and the VA Bell, I have not been able to find a spot on perfume oil dupe. I don't know why. Okay, this is pretty good. Wait. Ugh. Wait. No, 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 no. put it on my skin maybe I'll put it in the bad spot hold on no oh no it's so bad <laughs> oh no no uh-uh whatever nope no 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 <laughs> no and that the at first you're like okay yes it smells but something they try to put in there to recreate because Fenty is a complex perfume I will say that Fenty it goes through a lot of motions um, and it is a very complex perfume and so I do understand the difficulty in recreating that one this one no <laughs> from what I'm smelling here now I am going to let it sit for a couple of weeks to come back to it but please don't smell the scent for use Fenty and use that as a determination if you want to try the perfume please don't please don't no <laughs> no uh-uh y'all didn't do that one i'm so sorry okay miss summer dream this is a repurchase i've already had this one i've loved it i used it up this is um a dupe for the bath and body works version and for some reason i think i'm forgetting to show y'all these i'm so sorry um, for some reason, this is beast mode on me. Oh, it's so good. You can't put nothing nowhere else. Yes. For some reason, this is a beast mode perfume. I'm supposed to be working on a video. Um, 
talking about be smell perfume oils in my collection which I haven't smelled I haven't used and worn every single perfume oil in my collection to be honest but I do have enough um, that I've worn and know that they perform by themselves so I'm supposed to be compiling a video oh that's so good it's so sweet and pretty and beautiful um, and I actually I love the body care Miss summer dream I love wearing that with Valentino, Donna Born and Roma, Coral Fantasy. Um, so, that Midsummer Dream. I love, oh, I love that. Okay, Donna Born and Roma. Um, do I have had a perfume oil from Vision That Body Oils, and I'm almost done with that one. That perfume oil is spot on to Valentina Donna Born in Rome. I can't say that. Y'all, I'm telling you, this hack say my... If you... Because, like, the tape and stuff is clearly still on there. If that bothers you, then this hack won't work. I don't care. I don't feel like fussing around with all this tape. It takes time to take that tape off. Ain't I got time for that? Okay, let's see. Okay, hold on. From what I'm smelling in the... in the bottle... Hold on, that don't always mean... <laughs> Because you saw with Fenty. It smells really good. Can I say this is spot on? No. It smells like an Arabian perfume version of Donna Born Aroma. That's what it's giving me. Still smells good. We'll have no problem using this. But it's not spot on. But it smells very fruity and sweet. Almost like dragon fruit or something is in there. It smells good. But I can't say it's spot on. I think I only have Uno Mas. Oh, okay. This is Oud Satin Mood. Um, this one was one of their like, uh, I think they call it something. So this one won $250. This one I think was $10. So we're going to see what this is hitting on. There's something in it I like and there's something in it I don't like. I don't know about this one. There's something that smells good, but then there's something that doesn't. I don't know about this. <laughs> I don't know about this one. We're going to have to let that one sit and come back to it. We're going to have to let that one sit. Yeah, that Donna Board Aroma smells good. But, like, when I say, does it smell exactly like, I tried it. My gauge is, if I had never smelled the original perfume before, and because I do this sometimes, I'll buy a perfume and see what it smells like to see if it's something... To see, okay, if I like the perfume, then I would like the perfume. If I like the perfume oil, then I would like the perfume. So that's my gauge. That's my metric is, if I never smelled the perfume before, could I smell this perfume oil first and say, yes, I like this, and then blind buy the perfume? Because you know that's what I'm trying to do anyway is blind buy. <laughs> so that is my gauge. I, no, I can't smell this and say, yes, this smells exactly like the perfume. Use this. If you like this, then you can blind buy the perfume. Mm -mm, I can't say that. Can't say that. I've already lost young pistachio. Granted, I've smelled a lot of things today. There's probably 36 perfumes on my arm right now. So I can't for certain, but I can tell you right now, I don't smell young pistachio at all. I still smell the other stuff. That Fenty. Oh, that's still there going strong. I still smell the other stuff. I don't smell young pistachio. I mean, I don't smell it at all. Didn't I put it over here? I don't smell nothing. That is going to be the if I if the experience I'm having now is correct, although the young pistachio is close enough to the original, I can literally smell everything else that I put on. I can't smell that young pistachio. That is gonna be the difference maker. Which sometimes that happens with inex the like sometimes with perfume oils. You get what you pay for. Not all perfume oils are created equally. And I would not tell you that buying the $2.50 perfume oils, I would never say I can use this to replace all of my perfume oils. That's not true. <laughs> that is not true. There are some that I have that I have repurchased and will continue to repurchase from one specific, from that particular brand. Because it's made well, it lasts a long time. Like, the scent for you, it's, it's about trial and error. Please understand, it's about trial and error, okay? We tried a few and we errored a few, okay? <laughs> Y'all, I'm tired. I smell like 9,372 different things on my body. My stomach hurts for some unknown reason. Um, 
I got the air on because the, the lights is hot. Then because the air is and got the room cold, the heat and the furnace came on. It's so much going on right now. I got to go. <laughs> Got to go. But I love y'all all so much. Head over to the after party. Let me know. Because I know. I know y'all been shopping with the scent for you. I know y'all have. So go ahead and tell me what you done got. Tell me what your thoughts are. Tell me what's on your wish list. Go ahead and after party. Meet me there. And tell me what you think. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.